Hello, Sam for White Upgrade here, and today we've reached 100 subscribers. Hooray! I lied. It wasn't today, it was some time ago, but anyway, I've decided to make a video for that. I'm not at home, so I don't have my desktop. I have an old dual core laptop, uh, so it might, you know, the quality might not be as good as usual. Not that that's very high anyway, so uh, yeah. I thought we'd uh, do a space dragon, why not? So let's make a space dragon. And uh, yeah, I'm not going to edit this. I'm going to do it in real time, so it's going to be. Oh, look at all that. Oh, it's so blurry and pixely. It's beautiful. Oh, God. Okay, um, let's start out in the uh, vehicle assembly building. Okay, so the face of a dragon. I think. I think a dragon, if it went to space, would have a face like that. Um, right, okay. So a dragon would have. Uh, oh, look, I've just noticed the update. They've, they've made these. Uh, Funny show. Oh yeah, I've got some mods on here, um, but I won't be using any of them. Will symmetry work like that? No, it won't. Okay, well, we're going to have to put the eyes on manually then. So let's put a couple of dragon eyes on here. Docking ports look fairly good as eyes. Oh, beautiful. Okay, uh, dragons need to breathe fire, right? So let's, let's use this tiny little fuel tank. That can be its little reserve of fiery juice that it ejects from its throat, if I could speak today. I've also started this video without any water whatsoever. Haha. <laughs> so, my throat is literally uh, going to dry up and die at some point in the video. Where the hell is the little, the little tiny, uh, that'll do, the little ant engine. Let's turn it the right way up. Look at that. That, that <laughs> looks just like a dragon so far. Okay, so this is going to be the, the body of the dragon. I don't know how we're going to launch this and how my laptop's going to cope with this, actually. I should have thought about this. Never mind, it's too late. Um, we want a strut for the body. Let's use a strut. Because... Oh, wait, we want fuel, don't we? Oh, Christ, it's going to be really heavy. I don't want to use the mods. I want to use... This? Okay, we use that. It's going to be sort of a short and stubby... Stubby dragon got bullied on a lot because uh, he was quite fat and couldn't really fly very well. But anyway, we'll uh, we'll deal with that when we come to it. Um, also, it's not going to be able to breathe much fire. Never mind. Okay, let's give it some wings. So let's zoom out here. Ah, oh, it's already looking utterly, utterly ridiculous. Um, <laughs> it'll be really interesting to see if this dragon can actually fly. I doubt he can, but we'll give it a go. And if he experiences a fiery death, it's his own fault. Let's uh, stick some wings on here, and uh, yeah, that looks that's just like a dragon. Yeah, I mean, it, if you don't think that looks like a dragon, go screw yourself. I think it does. All right, for propulsion, let's have. Um, we don't want we don't want massive propulsion, do we? We're going to be in space, but on the, uh, the on the other hand, we don't want too little because he's as fat as anything. That looks pretty good to me. That looks damn good. Dragon hasn't got any feet. Should we give the dragon? Okay, we'll give him some feet. But I don't really want to make this stage too heavy, otherwise it's going to be utterly ridiculous to fly. And we'll handle like a tugboat or a Jensen interceptor. So, it's, oh, gee, bloody symmetry doesn't work in this mode. No, not that. I'm an idiot. No. Oh god, it's all going wrong. Okay. Um, something tells me uh, I won't get to the point of being able to land this this thing. But hey, optimism. I'm full of optimism, right? We all know that. Okay. Let's put you some wheels on there. Lovely. Gorgeous. Sexy dragon. Right. Uh, yeah. There we go. Right. I don't really want to fire the... Uh, how come that's not... Oh, there's the engines there. Okay. I don't really want to fire the ant engine at the same time. We don't want to waste our fiery breath, do we? Let's move that down before I forget later on. Okay. So that is it. Uh, unfortunately, the dragon though is a bit shit, and he needs a bit of assistance getting into uh, outer space. So we're gonna have to build some sort of horrendous launch stage for him. So let's get a decoupler. Is that the big decoupler? Where are the big decouplers? Is that it? Yeah. Very nice. Yes. Progress. Um. Yeah. Let's give him a big launch stage. This could be like the mummy dragon that carries its baby into space. Um, if we're trying to stick with realism, which we're totally not, but let's go with that anyway. And I think we want on there, by the time we're in that height, I think we only want 
an engine that doesn't have thrust vectoring, that doesn't matter too much, does it? So uh, which one's that? Is it that one? It's this one. There we are. Fantastic. So that'll that'll be the secondary burner. We need um, primary. I can see this going so well, can't you? How can it fail, possibly? Great giant rocket. Uh, doing all this. Oh, I've also invested in a telescope because as, <laughs> as thick as I am uh, with astrophysics and all that, I, I really does interest me, actually. So I bought a telescope. It, it was £50 reduced to 15 so I assume it's going to be the best telescope anyone has ever bought. I'm lying, it'll be crap, but whatever. So uh, I, I don't know, I might upload some photos or videos of space, probably not because that would be really boring, but um, yeah, I'm trying to have an active interest in space and what's going on and watching Scott Manley's videos really do, um, you know, they interest me and he always goes on about space and I wish I wish I could talk about other stuff he talks about, but I'm uh, pretty stupid, so let's not do that. All right. So these have thrust vectoring on them, these are going to be used for uh, steering, and um, we'll have a couple of couple of solid rocket boosters on as well because the dragon's pretty damn heavy right so I don't want him to fall flat on his ass as soon as we launch. They want to fire at the same time and we want to decouple the... why isn't it showing up? Damn it! Highlight yourself! There we go. Alright so we want to decouple that, decouple them, when they decouple we want to fire this engine right? And then, yeah, I think that's it. I think, yeah, we're looking good. We're looking good. We want some power, of course, because in this version, you require power to move and live and to breathe. So let's stick it on the nose. A couple of solar panels, why not? The dragon doesn't need that much power. Sort of going to take him into orbit if I can, and then um, he will meet his fiery doom. But that's uh, that's yet to be seen. Let's put a couple of these launch clamps on. Glorious. I mean, it's going to fly first time, right? So let's. Call it Dragon. Final. There we go. Everything flies first time. Now I don't know how long this is going to take or what it's going to look like with this laptop, but hey, let's keep our fingers crossed. I've talked about a load of crap this episode. Um, I do apologise, but I really wanted to try out doing live commentary instead of editing all the time. Oh! Oh dear. Okay, uh. well when I said launch the first time, I meant the second time, because, yeah, first time would be boring, right? Or would it be more boring to see me build this a million times? I don't know. Let's um, move these up. Let's move these up here, see if that does it. Maybe I don't have enough launch clamps, I don't know. Let's save it. And we shall see if it falls flat on its arse. Which I sincerely hope it does. Uh, uh, okay. I'm going to launch before anything else goes wrong. No! Uh-oh. 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 Oh, Jesus. Fine. Whatever. Whatever. Don't care. Okay, the dragon's pretty <laughs> pretty heavy. Um, I guess I should have expected that, I think. Let's um, fix that problem. I've been saying erm a lot as well. I've been trying not to do it. But when you actively try to do something, I find you do it more. Down to you. <laughs> yes. Okay, let's put some delicious solid rocket boosters on. This isn't going to go well, I can't see me getting into atmosphere, but never mind. Uh, these want to go... Where do these want to go? They want to go here, right? Yeah? I think they do, over here? Yeah? Okay, good. Thank you for telling me. Really needed to know. Oh, then they want to ditch these there. I think. Never mind. It'll go wrong anyway. Let's try it. Let's go. But um, 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 okay. It's gonna work. Let's go. Launch. Oh Jesus. Oh Jesus. Oh God. Okay, so the dragon's um, a little bit heavier than I expected. It's, um, well, we're getting there, we're getting there. Uh, the dragon is uh, starting to tip over slightly. Although I think we're in control. Uh, 
burning up a lot of fuel to try to move out here. I think we're going to need some more thrust. Uh, possibly, possibly replace these engines with insects. Go dragon, be free! Oh god, I just shot him. Oh, sorry. Okay, never mind. Let's try that again. Should have thought about this video before I started it. Really, shouldn't I? Never mind. Never mind. Let's get rid of these and put main sails on them. Although that's probably going to make it harder to uh, manoeuvre. But never mind. Save launch. I have every faith in you, my dragon. Dovakin. Okay, let's uh, put computer controls on. Thrust to the max. Go! Ah, that's a bit better, isn't it? Still, we're burning a lot of fuel up. That's not good. Um, hopefully, that will get high enough so that we can detach and not fall backwards. But I'm starting to think. Uh, yeah, that's not good. Um, we're going to have to throw up the throttle back, but I don't think we can afford, afford the thrust at the moment. Can we? No, I don't think we can. Come on, man, we can do this. I wonder if the uh, real space dragons have this problem. Actually, they probably just fly into space because they're not as stupid as my design. Never mind. Not uh, much G. Not much G, though. That's good, right? I've kept the pilots alive. I don't really care about that. I just want to get into space. I'm going to have to get rid of the solid rocket boosters in a minute. Uh, watch the speed plummet. Hooray! Also, just realised we have no reaction wheels for when we uh, get out of the atmosphere and the control services don't work, so hooray for that as well. We're actually not doing too badly at the moment. At five, six thousand feet and our speed is climbing again, but our engines are overheating and there's not much fuel left. Half a tank each, probably. Yeah, we've used all that up. Oh dear. Never mind, we can make it. I have every faith in the dragon. Let's put his legs away. His legs don't need to be up at the moment. There you go. Uh, try and get him into atmosphere and we'll try and land him, I suppose. But, I mean, it, it might be a bit more difficult uh, <laughs> than just strapping a load of engines to him, as I have done. I think I should use that. Uh, what's that design that uh, lots of people do use? Is it like a the hexagon design or something? Uh, asparagus, that's it, asparagus rockets. They look pretty damn good, but I don't tend to use those because I'm lazy. So... Although, I don't know. I'll try it if this fails. I'm hoping it doesn't fail because my throat's already giving out and uh, I'm not even in orbit yet. And I don't think I'm going to get into orbit because now I have to ditch these engines, leaving me with a single mainsail. Ditch! Okay, speed is actually climbing. That was unexpected. I, I thought we'd have problems at this stage. Let's have a look. Yeah, you'll notice I've got the key thing mod on, but we're not going to be using that because I don't think the dragon's manoeuvrable enough. Right, we should have turned over a long time ago, I think. Yes, we should. Okay, bad start. We should have turned over a long time ago, so now getting into orbit's going to be a very interesting manoeuvre indeed. So, a little uh, graphics glitch there, that was weird. Let's turn over there. Weird orbit so far. Don't think we can have enough fuel. I'm a pessimist. Maybe I can take some of the dragon's fuel, maybe? Maybe I'll steal some of his fuel. Mm. Let's do that. Sorry, dragon. There we go. Hopefully now I can limp along into orbit. Huzzah and hurrah. This video wasn't pointless after all. And I don't think it's taken that long, actually. I haven't been timing it, but... Hopefully we can get there, and I've just talked about a load of bollocks. Okay, so, yeah, we're in a bit of a steep climb at the moment. Ideally, I'd like this to be a little bit more shallow, so that it wouldn't take such a long burn to get into orbit. Um, we are overheating slightly. Ever so slightly. But uh, I'm not worried. The dragon can take it. He knows his shit. Uh, okay, let's, let's just try burning completely horizontally now and see if we can pick up enough speed to orbit around the planet, that would be lovely. Actually, we might be able to. <laughs> it's ridiculous. Oh uh, dear. It doesn't even look like a drone. It's basically just a large rocket with docking ports on it and a small engine at the front. Uh, 
brilliant. Oh, okay, that's not going so badly at the moment. So let's cut the engines and wait until we get to upper laps. Bit of time acceleration, don't want to do too much because the laptop might explode. There we go. I've forgotten the buttons to uh, throttle up and down instantly. I think X, X will kill the engines, yeah, I know that much. But uh, I don't know the key to fully throttle, as it were. Let's get in. Yes! Come on, my dragon. Yes! Glorious. Okay, maybe quoting Robaz there, but... He's a damn good YouTuber and you should watch him. Pretty damn hilarious. Okay, uh, orbit. Huzzah, we're in orbit. Okay, now, <laughs> second part of the challenge. Land this. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to do it either. Don't worry about that. Okay, let's um, slap him with our penises. We're going to go around and try and land on the light side, preferably near the space station. Not space station, what am I talking about? The Kerbal Space Center. Let's get rid of that. Very nice. Don't know why the bloody fairing didn't come off, but whatever. Let's go. Zip soup soup a dip up around the planet. Zip soup soup a dip up. I don't know where the space center is. Uh, well, let's try and figure it out. Um, is it? It's not in a desert, is it? Is it there? I don't know. Let's aim for there. Let's aim for there. Uh, let's turn the ship around so that we can do a retrograde burn and try and land it. I'll try and land it on the gears, but let's face it, <laughs> the wings I've put on there probably aren't strong enough to carry it. But hey, he had a good life, right? He got into orbit, Space Dragon's done his job. So let's do that. Ah, oh, this engine's pretty hefty, actually. Burns fuel slowly. Oh, that's kind of cool, I don't know why I haven't used that before. Alright, that's coming down, periaps, let's just put that in the sea somewhere and we can glide down and use the air friction to stop. Uh, about there maybe? I don't know, I don't know, I don't know anything about this, let's just try and do it. Point ourselves in the right direction, that'd be nice. No, not upside down, uh, whatever, whatever, you crazy dragon. That's it. And about there, there's our prograde. So now we can go and plummet to the planet face first. Fantastic. Okay. Oh, he's naturally rotating. He wants to. He wants to look at his prey. He wants to see. Set his sights on the landing. I respect you, dragon. Okay. Fantastic. Right. We are lined up. I'm going to time accelerate till we're a bit lower. And we're going <laughs> to we're going to land. Somewhat. Um, times four. Oh, oh dear. Okay, starting to have a few stability problems here. We're going to hit the atmosphere. Oh, fantastic. We might land in the sea. I don't want to land in the sea. Oh, I don't want to land in the sea. Oh no, we're coming. We're coming down the air. We should. We should land. Uh, although I think we're dropping like a stone at the moment, which is bad. Perhaps I could try and. I could try and land it like a rocket. But really... Oh, look at him wiggling his tail. Beautiful. Let's try and land it like a rocket. Let's see if that helps. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful ballerina skills. Yes! So beautiful. Bringing a tear to my eye. Okay, let's try and land it... Let's try and land it like a rocket. I should have put some parachutes on here or something, I don't know. Are we supposed to be skimming across the sea, actually? Yes, we are. Oh, probably should be burning then. Oh, crap, okay. Um, I guess it's aerodynamic enough to glide. <laughs> yeah, let's fire the... Let's fire the bloody mouth cannon now, because I don't think we're going to get a chance to do it again. If I can get it in the right place. Let's just thrust a bit. Look at the steering. Yeah, Mr. Dragon. Your uh, course has been laid in. You're going to die. Let's watch it fire. Are you ready? I know I am. <sighs> Look at that. Looks just like a dragon. 
just like it. Are you burning? He's burning the bloody. Did I stop? There. They <laughs> started burning up the. Oh dear, wait, we've come into the atmosphere. Okay, time for me to uh, concentrate. Oh god. Oh, it's so stable. It's so stable. Glorious. No. Please. Just straight. Just go straight. Just go straight. Mute controls. I don't think I can do a very good job of this compared to the computer. That looks pretty cool. <laughs> uh, the space dragon rises again. But, uh, am I going to make it to the island? I think I might, you know. I think I might. And actually, we're not plummeting to the earth like a stone, so that's not a bad thing. Why am I accelerating? Oh, because I'm going to not make it to the island otherwise. Crap! Okay, no problem. Bill, you must sacrifice yourself to the dragon god. Goodbye. Goodbye, Bill. Okay, he sacrificed himself so that we may live. <laughs> See you later, man. See you later. Oh, uh, we've made it to the island. Let's cut the thrust and hope we slow down. No, thrust back on, thrust back on. It was good, it was helping. Ah, all is calm. Maybe we'll be better at a lower speed, or maybe it's because we're losing fuel in the front. Who cares? I'm not going to land, let's face it. No, okay, we're starting to drop. See our pro raids dropping there? That's bad. Oh, uh, uh, oh, God! It handles like a tugboat. Jesus. Okay, okay. Uh, little baby adjustments. Baby adjustments. Up, 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 up. Okay, stay here. That's good. That's, no, don't do that. Bollocks. Cut the thrust. Does that help? That makes things considerably worse. <laughs> considerably worse, okay. Thrust! No, don't spin out of control. Oh dear. Oh dear. Uh, oh, wait, wait, wait. Okay, maybe we can maybe we can land this like a rocket. Maybe we can give it a go. Maybe I, oh god, what if I can? Do I have enough fuel? I don't think many dragons land like this, actually, but we are. We're going to land like this. Uh, I've also just forgot my laptop doesn't cast shadows, so it's going to be kind of difficult to land on the engine. But let's try it. Uh, I don't think we're that far off. Are we? I would check inside the rocket, but I'm kind of worried about crashing at the moment. Let's have a look. Where's the altimeter? No. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. How do I? How do I get out of? Uh. <laughs> I'm stuck. I'm stuck in the the wrong view. I don't know how to check how to get out of it. Um. Do what? I I thought it was V. Is it I? Is it C? C. C. Good. 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 Okay. It's, you know, that's fine. That's how professional I am. No, Mr. Dragon. Come on, come on, come on. Just fall back down like a stone. If I can just soften the impact so they survive. Please. Oh, yes. Okay, I consider that a, a success. His eyes have fallen off, but they have lived. Okay, I hope this hasn't been as boring for you as it seems to have for me. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.